Hey all YouTube guys, this is uh, your friend Metifu. So I'm here to bring you guys an insight on how to fix a flickering TV. This could possibly be applicable to other TVs. This is a Crosscan 55 inch. So I went ahead and opened this TV and one of the first things that I always check whether the TV's image or no sound goes off um, is you always want to start with your main power supply. I mean, essentially your power always comes to here and from here it gets distributed to to all of the other uh, power slaves for the LCD screen and as well as your uh, video and all, all that stuff and as well as your sound. So, um, what I've noticed with this particular TV is these capacitors here that I have in my hand is what I remove. Now if you notice on the top of these guys, let me see if I can focus it in there. Here it is. The tops of these have a slight, a, a slight bulge like if they were going to pop. So I found that three of these on the main board power supply were presenting that same problem. That's my compressor because I was about to dust off the TV. So there's the other third one. So these guys were exactly here on the motherboard where I have replaced it with these other guys. Which these guys have no longer, these guys were just parts. I always keep around spare parts. So I replaced three of them. These guys and these guys. And those were the only capacitors that I was able to see that presented you know a problem a, a, a physical problem that I was able to see without having to do much of a thorough scan um, the all of the video side components seem fine so once I replace that you know the, the flickering stop so let me show you guys you plug it in Sorry for the view, I'm just trying to hook up the uh, air compressor over here. Just hang tight. Hang tight, guys. Okay, so... Right at the bottom, you can see the little red light. That's the indication that there's power in the system. Now, you want to be very careful if you ever plug in the TV with the back open. Make sure that you, there's no kits around playing, because if they touch any of those components they're gonna get a nice shock so let's power around this TV can't hear that click on the back so let's wait for it so when that was first brought to me right away as soon as the uh, image of the HDMI of whatever input was active it was just flickering so now it's all nice and steady and if I Go my go to my menu. Well, now this is it's a nice solid screen. It's no longer flickering. So that's how I went about fixing this problem. I hope you know this helps you guys in troubleshooting your TV. Now that doesn't necessarily mean that all the TVs are gonna have the same problem, but what I can tell you is that if there is if there's not a visible problem in your main power supply, then most likely your problem is going to be not here. It's going to be either in the uh, power slaves for the TV or um, some other component, possibly the, the main board for the uh, image and all of that stuff. But again, you know, this is, this works this worked for the uh, ProScan 55 inch. Um, but, you know, at least it gives you an idea of what to look for in your own TVs. All right, guys. Well, stay safe and uh, hope this video it's uh, useful for you guys peace out